Good morning, everybody. Stetson with Stetslanka here. Today, guys, it is mulch day, <clears throat> and we are at my cousin's shop. He is about to load up some uh, mulch for me. Two pallets right there of grade A cedar. So uh, I guess I'll go ahead and record this. He's going to be using the skid steer. So let's do it. Alright guys, so we had uh, no choice but to tip it on there, so it kind of failed horribly, but hey man, it works. I'm going to come back and get another pallet another day, but shout out to my cousin, Tender Lawn Care. I'll plug his Instagram down in the uh, in the bio, or not the bio, in the comment section, whatever it is. I haven't done this in a long time, so I'm not used to it, but we got one, one pallet of mulch, which should be enough in theory for today fingers crossed we'll have to see but anyway guys we will catch you guys at the first drops all right so i am actually doing a voiceover right here because the course the microphone was to cut out but so over here we are cutting cut, we cut down all that ornamental grass already put in bags uh we're putting mulch here that's basically what i'm saying here we're cutting down the bamboo right there and then we come over here we're pruning that grass and there's the same stuff exactly uh the same way across from it we're cutting down this horsetail reed about a foot. We're cutting it down about a foot lower than it is now. Then we came down to this flower bed and uh, they were pruning all that ornamental grass. There was about probably like 15, 20 grasses in that bed. And now I'm just asking Jackson how he's doing. He says he's doing good. But of course, uh, I have the, like I said guys, I have the new GoPro here in 9. And not sure if it's something with that mixing with the microphone adapter maybe it's glitching but sometimes the clips don't record the uh sound with the microphone so i have no clue really really weird but uh so i guess we're doing that and then we're heading back here and then up on that ledge up there we're cutting more ornamental grass right up there so next up in the video is us trimming that so let's get to it Okay, so right here, I'm sure I'll get a bunch of questions, um, as I always do, about why I do things the way I do. But we are using a bag here as opposed to a tarp because, guys, this day it was super, super windy. As you can see, all the weeds blowing. And so if we used a tarp, um, they would have just ended up all over the grass. So I figured it was way easier to uh, just go ahead and throw them in a bag instead of having to rake up all, like the whole yard and it would end up in the meadow and all that stuff. Just didn't want to deal with that, so the bag made much more sense to me.
finishing up back there. Uh, I started up, just started uh, trimming this horsetail reed. So like they're cutting about a foot off. Uh, stopped to grab the camera so I can record this, but let's go ahead and get this done. All right, everybody. So we are fit up here. Got the horse tail reed trimmed. Sorry if it's windy. Uh, we're not pruning that stuff. Got this stuff trimmed up, leaving those. Jackson just cleaned some leaves out over here, but he is starting to mulch. Jackson is. So I'll go ahead and record him mulching. But some of you guys are curious. I'm sure we we'll use platinum grade A cedar. And uh, I love this stuff. This is what I've always used and but the price of this stuff is going up this year so it is a little gonna be a little more expensive for all the clients but whatever what can you do right it's part of the business uh, record Jackson getting it done Let's do All right, everybody. So we are finally done here. Mulched, 
Got a mulch, got the horsetail reed cut to about a foot lower than it was. Got this cut down, mulch back there. Mulch all up here, back there. This is a big job, guys. I think we end up using like 40 bags, 45 bags around there. And then uh, back here, got this part mulched up. Looks good. Got the weeds pulled out of that flower bed. And then got this one all pruned and mulched. So guys, everything looks good. We we're done here. We were here about five and a half hours. So we're gonna head to uh, the next one, which is a commercial. So probably won't be recording there. Maybe I will a little bit, who knows? So we'll catch you guys in a little bit. Oh my gosh. All right, everybody. So I am just beat. It is, it is 6.07. So we got home at six. It was a really long day of mulching especially, but it's all right, cause we did we did we didn't get it all done we at the commercial property we were at we had a whole pallet of mulch a whole a, mul, a, a little a pallet came comes in 28 or in 28 a pallet comes in 68 comes 68 bags of mulch and we used that whole thing today and we still need some more so i got we're getting i guess we're getting some severe weather overnight some really bad hail rain wind whatever so i went ahead put some more mulch in the back of the truck and uh tarped it over so it doesn't get wet and then we're gonna go tomorrow and jackson and i are just gonna go do it because it's gonna be raining so it'll be quick easy day tomorrow but man i'm ready to take a nice shower and lay in bed and relax a little and eat some food all i've ate today is some peanut butter and jelly crackers so anyway guys hopefully y'all are doing well hopefully you enjoyed this video it was don't know how long it'll be who knows but it was first mowing vlog that we've done so i'm excited not mowing vlog first work vlog of this season so i am pumped guys real pumped but anyway guys we will catch you in the next video peace out